Hi, I'm here with my really good friend, Ken Campbell, who is the president of Jaku Combat, one of the most remarkable youth organizations in our community here in Ottawa. And one of the great things Jaku Combat has been doing every year is to celebrate Kwanzaa with all of our Ottawa's black community. So Ken, first tell me a little bit about what's Kwanzaa. Kwanzaa is a dynamic, non-religious cultural celebration that we celebrate every year from December 26th to January the 1st. Celebration really focused on family, community, and culture. So it's a, a great time to bring family and the community together to reinforce the bond, their shared experience, their shared culture, and to commit themselves to something better in the future. It's an amazing uh, celebration. It's lots of music, lots of festivities, a lot of inspiration I always find. But speaking of inspiration, Jaku Combat is an amazing organization helping so many youths and seniors uh, in our community, especially coming from the black community. Mm -hmm. Tell me a little bit about the work you're doing and how Kwanzaa inspires the work that you do. Well, Jaku Kambi literally means Africans helping Africans. It's an organization whose focus is to promote and to project the best of the African Caribbean uh, culture, uh, their heritage, and to foster a sense of cultural pride and to promote a strong, a vibrant community. So over the years, we have been able to sustainable develop uh, long-lasting programs that really engage and support our participants. We have a tutoring program called Black Star Tutoring, which really focus on academic support for students who need that extra help in math, English, French, and science. We have a mentorship program that engage young people with mentors in the community. And we just started a very dynamic, important program called Black Youth Entrepreneur and Innovation. And that program is about having a conversation and engaging young people with a business idea and to help them to scale up their business so they can be very successful. So we provide information and workshop, and we also provide some financial incentive to get their program or their business up and running. So the whole goal and activity of Jaku Combat is really based upon the principles of Kwanzaa, and there are seven principles. As you can see, we have seven candles here representing the seven days of Kwanzaa. And each of those days have a particular value and principles. And each of those principles are tied in perfectly with the goal, the mission, and purpose of, of Jaku Kambi. So our program is about Omoja, which is one of the first day of Kwanzaa, the first candle, which means unity. And it's about promoting unity. It's about fostering cooperation with everyone, the family and the community. The second candle as well represents the second day is Kujichagulia. And that means self-determination, about promoting and encouraging us to learn, to understand, and to be able to articulate our story and our message and to share it with, not only with, within our community, but with the larger community in which we belong. And you go to each of the days of the celebration, each of the principle, and it ties in very perfectly with the work and the mission of Jaku Kambi. Well, listen, uh, love everything you do. Love you as a friend. Mm -hmm. um, you've got a small but mighty team mm -hmm. that's making an impact in so many lives. And proud of the work you're doing. Keep up the good work and we'll continue to keep working. Happy Thank Kwanzaa. You. Happy Kwanzaa. Thank you so much, uh, Yasuo. You've been, been a big supporter of Jakukum for many years. And we really appreciate all the help and the support and the positive vibe that you've sent our way. Thank you so much. And happy holidays and happy Kwanzaa to Same you and your you. family. Same to you, Thank my you. friend. Thank you.